as I've said before, in my view, housing is the single most urgent and important social issue facing our country at this moment in time. And it is one I am determined that we as a government get to grips with. Access to housing is not just about the immediate material need for a roof over your head, although the absolute tragedy of homelessness is one that we are determined to eliminate by the end of the decade. It is about much more than that. Access to housing is fundamental to our security, stability, health and progress as a nation. When a family has a secure tenure in a safe and comfortable home, children have the peace and the potential to do better at school and develop their wider personality and sense of identity. Parents have the freedom and the confidence to engage with and help develop their local communities and build sporting, artistic and cultural connections. Communities of secure, engaged and confident households are safer, more enriched and happier places to live. A country of engaged and contented communities is a more attractive place to visit, establish a business or invest in. And greater prosperity means more investment in education and healthcare, more opportunities for our young people and better outcomes for everyone. It all comes back to housing. And right now, we are in a housing crisis. There are not enough homes being built and a generation of people are demoralized and close to despair on the issue. There is scarcely a family in the country untouched by the crisis. And if we do not recognize the scale of the challenge and respond in kind, it has the potential to be profoundly destabilizing for our country. The plan we are presenting today recognizes the scale of the challenge. Housing for all is unprecedented in our country's history in terms of its scope, its scale, and its ambition. It is supported by the largest ever housing budget in our history and represents a direct and radical intervention in the housing market by the Irish state.